The linear and circular component patterning tool is a lot like the patterning tool for features. You will need to specify the direction, spacing between parts, number of instances, and the components you want to pattern. Unlike the mirroring tool, you cannot create an opposite hand version of a component or create a new document. To create a linear component pattern, click on the linear component pattern tool. First, select an edge to determine the direction you want the component to pattern in. Then select the distance between the components. Determine the number of instances to create. And finally, select the component you would like to pattern. Again, you can select some instances to skip. Once you are done, you can close the tool and you will have your parts added. These parts will be shown in the feature tree as a local pattern. Now we can look at circular patterning a component. For this example, I will pattern a bolt in a VEX Pro Versa Hub. Go to the Assembly tab and click on the drop down arrow on Linear Components and click Circular Pattern. First, select the arc you want it to follow or an axis to revolve around. Then, you can specify the separation between instances. The next tab is to specify the number of instances to create. You can also click on the Equal Spacing checkbox to make it create an equal amount of spacing between the components along the specified angle. For example, right now we would like there to be 6 bolts around 360 degrees of the part. So we can click on the equal spacing checkbox, specify 6 components, and make sure it is going around 360 degrees. Finally, you can select the components to pattern and the instances you would like to skip, the same way as the linear pattern tool. When you close the tool, you will notice that the pattern is added to your feature tree. This tool can be useful if you need to add many parts around a circular axis. These tools are made so you can efficiently create an assembly. Hopefully now you understand the basic concepts of the linear and circular patterning tools, and you can use them if needed.